Here. Hold on. Hold on. He, he ain't getting away. Hey, y'all. I'm joined today by Mike Arrigo from Arrigo Outdoor Adventures. We're going to show you a quick and effective way to get on these spring crappie. Stay tuned. You're not going to want to miss this. There you go. You're down. You're down. You're down. Uh, oh, got him. Camera. <laughs> I forgot my camera. All right, y'all. That was not even five minutes. Three minutes? Is that a bass? That's a crappie, oh, brother. That's a crappie. Oh, there we go. Mike, look at that, guys. Mike's down. Oh, oh that's a decent one. We just got two crappie. Oh, you didn't bring your camera? I got to go grab my camera real quick. Guys, we just doubled up. <laughs> I forgot my camera. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Just doubled up. We're going to add those to the bucket for right now. And we're going to have to go get the cooler. How easy was that, Mike? Not even five minutes. We caught two fish. You're going to want to record this, that's for sure. Look at this real quick. We literally did this in the first two minutes. Jim caught one, and I caught one. I can get them out of the bucket. Literally in the first two minutes. Guys, if you watch the previous video, there we go. There we go. Nope, oh, I missed him. Mike's got him. Got him. Get him, Mike. There's crappie number three, y'all. That is a bass. No, no, that's a crappie. That's a crappie. Yep. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Big old fat black crappie. That fast. We're getting out here and getting on these crappie. That's three crappie in less than 10 minutes, y'all. There you go. Oh, I'm under. Down, Got him. <laughs> and that is a nice one. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh yeah. That was beautiful black crappie right there, y'all. What I may have to do is go get the cooler. Yeah. Because that bucket's filling up awfully quick. Mike, you're under. I'm under. Got him. Look at that guys. Mike's got another one. Oh yeah. Look at that guys. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And basically what we're doing is just a simple slip corking with a minnow. Look at that. So that throw it in. Got him. Oh wow. That's a nice one. <laughs> Guys, look at that. Oh, this is just too much fun. Look at that, y'all. Beautiful. Look at that, y'all. Put these in here. Yep. I'll go get some water. Filling up the cooler already. Nothing like spring crappie fishing, y'all. There is nothing like it. Well, what's even crazier is the fact that we have not caught a bass or anything. You think the bass would come in here and slam these minnows as well? That y'all, right there, less than 15 minutes is why you down, get it. You're down, you're down, you're <laughs> down. Got it. Oh, that's a, that's a better fish. Come here, baby. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Beautiful. Nice black crappie. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You, sir. Beautiful. Look at that, y'all. Oh yeah. I was surprised I cast over by those willows all day yesterday and did not get nothing. Hmm. And that's when I found them out here suspended. You know when they talk about being suspended, they have to be because there's no structure right there. There we go. Mike's down right. guys. Got him. Oh beautiful. Look at that one. Nice. Check that out y'all. Yes, sir. There he is. Or there she is. Beautiful. Nice black crappie. Look at that. Yep. See? Got him. I told you, it's that spot. Yep. I twitched, twitched, and he nailed it. <laughs> oh, I'm down. You're down. This is number nine. Got him. That There's number, number 10. 10. There we go, y'all. That's the second time we've doubled up today. That's a white crappie. Yes, it is. This one here's a black crappie. Oh, sorry, Mike. 
Sorry, Hit me with your long pole, Jim. Don't do that. Sorry, man. It happens. Sometimes, sometimes it has a mind of its own. We have found the crappie, y'all. And once you find them, you start creating moments like this right here. Look at that. And that's the thing. Sometimes they want it still with no press, no uh, movement. Sometimes they want it, you know, shallow. Yeah. But by you twitching or going coming up a little bit or going down a little bit, you know, that changes the bite right back on. Ah. That is the joy of spring crappie fishing. So we've caught about 11 y'all and we've missed three. So that's not bad. Come on, get them. Got them. Nice. Beautiful. There's number 12, y'all. Hey guys, that's a white crappie. Now, Mike, did you go deeper? Nope. That's the same depth it's been the whole time. Nice. Makes you wonder how big a school it is. There we go. You're down. Got him. That's a beautiful fish. Look at that. Absolutely. Number 13, y'all. Number 13. Lucky 13. Oh yeah. And that was all the way down there, not even close to where we were catching these ones. Beautiful, look at that. Add that to the cooler. I saw, there we go. Got him. <laughs> Number 14. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. For 14, black crappie. <laughs> oh, this is so much fun. Where'd that come from? There we go. Oh, he hit it. Come on. Go hit it again. Beautiful. There we go. Got him. Uh, oh, that's a nice. There's one. number 15, y'all. Nice crappie. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Huh? Got him. Number 16. You're, you're Mike, your own Mike, grab this other one. Come on, brother. <laughs> Set it. Number 17. <laughs> I'm like, you're down. You're really, you're pulling like, no, your other one. <laughs> Guys, I had two poles in. Mike went and grabbed that one for me. Look at that. Look at that. Beautiful. We got 17 crappie in the cooler, y'all. Look at that. Oh, thank you, sir. Do I still have a minnow? Yeah. Yeah, throw that bad boy back out throw there. Back out there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is fun. Yes, it is. Yes, sir. Here you go. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Look at that, fellas. When you're catching so many fish that you need someone else to, help to grab your other pole. That is what I'm talking about. Yep. 17 so far, y'all. 17. Well, you know, when you first catch them, they feel like a bass. Yeah. And you're like, that's a bad. You're like, no, that's a crappie. A good, healthy crappie. Mike, what is your favorite reason to use live bait? My favorite reason to use live bait? Yeah. What, why is live bait so much more different and enjoyable, in your opinion, than, than plastics? Well, I prefer catching over fishing, don't we all? However, there's times where I'm just really impatient fisherman and you tend to catch more with live bait just because it's more natural. All your artificial baits are imitating live bait. The pros to artificial baits are you can use them over and over and over. The cons are they're just not quite as good as live bait. That's all. But live bait, it's cons, it dies on you, it's messy, and it gets expensive. But it's all it's it's a matter of preference i grew up using live bait i prefer live bait that's all and i get a lot of action from it absolutely i agree 100 percent. guys in my own personal fishing experiences i've had times where we've gone out throwing plastics and all kinds of stuff and the only thing they would hit is live bait in one of those scenarios if you actually check out the video linked below mike and i go out with chris from pistol creek pan fishing we were throwing trout magnets wasn't really getting any bites we threw the minnows on and all of a sudden the bite turned on they wanted that live bait that's the other great part i think about live bait mike is you're fishing with it you have the ability to catch every species of fish right right you know 
Well, people say, well, I'm targeting crappie. Well, we're all targeting crappie. But, you know, if you put a minnow out there, you're going to catch crappie, sunfish, bass, there you go. catfish. You just had a hit on it. Um, shell cracker. So, just so many different opportunities with live bait. <laughs> That's a crappie. Look at that, guys. Put that on the crappie magnet. Man. Great job, Mike. Another Good job. black crappie. You got that on the white crappie magnet. White and chartreuse with the gold head. You know, that's a, also the great thing about the trout magnets. They're a great search oh, bait. there we go. Another one. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Number two on the trout magnet. The trout magnet is getting it done, and that is a beautiful crappie. Another black crappie. Good job, Mike. Look at that, huh? So I'm talking about. Well, see, that's when you switch over to the trout magnet. Yep. I'm going to drop this yep. a little bit deeper. Yep. See what happens. So. Guys, when the bite slows down, just drop your bait deeper. See what happens. Yeah, because they might have just dropped down to the bottom. We've seen, you and I have seen them do that so much on live scope and on the aqua view, where they're biting, biting, biting. We're not getting anything. And all of a sudden, guys, we're go onto the live scope, we're like, well, let's just drop down because we know they're in this area and we'll watch them come up off the bottom. Mike, you're under, Mike, you're under. I'm under. And he's got him, y'all. I got him. Oh, that's a beautiful one. There we go. Look at that. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, right off the bank. Fat, flat, crappy. Look at that, guys, huh? Oh, yeah. Beautiful color. Right off Beautiful the bank. Good job, fish. brother. One. Beautiful. Two. Mike's got him, y'all. Very nice. Nice Oh, yeah. Good job, Mike. Look at that one. That's number 21. Oh, we ain't going anywhere right now. Mike's got one, y'all. Get him out of there, brother. Here. Hold on, hold on. He he ain't getting away. Bring him over here. He keeps swimming around that. Yeah, there you go. Bring him to me. Here he comes. Here, don't fall in. Your line is around that stuff. Can you come out this way? Them. I'm gonna get this there first. You go. you got Hold on. <laughs> Guys, oh, the stuff I do yeah. for my brother in law. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Thank you, sir. Pull up the bank. That's caving in. Look oh at my that, goodness. <laughs> Look what I just caught. An alive minnow. Big old pregnant female. Caught in the roof of the mouth. That's what I'm talking about, Mike. Cool. Guys, look at that. Mike went down just like a crappie. Look what Mike just caught. Once again, he didn't understand the assignment. <laughs> Big old pregnant female. Hey, that's the other thing. We're talking about fishing with live bait. You get a chance to catch those. Yep. That is awesome, that's Mike. Cool. Got Mike's got another one, y'all. Nice. Bass or a crappie? Uh, no, it's a crappie. Beautiful. Like a bass. Look at that. <laughs> That is awesome. Guys, we are having some fun today. Mm -mm -mm. Live bait fishing at its best. Yep. You like the bass fish? Beautiful. Put on a minnow. You like the crappie fish? Put on a minnow. You like the fish? Put on a freaking minnow. You'll catch fish. Mike has found Mike has found the school, y'all. Hey Mike, what you got there? Got me a black crappie. Yeah, but remember you and I caught those? Got them. Got a crappie, y'all. All right. Mike, you caught two crappie down there? Yeah. And this one, so now we're up to 23 or 24? I think that's number 24 right there. That is crazy, y'all. We have caught 24 crappie in, in less than an hour.
That is phenomenal. Look at that. Probably should. Oh, here we go. Catch him! Catch him! Got him. Got him. That's another crappie, y'all. Look at that. Oh no, that's a bass. No, nope, got him a bass. Got us a bass. All right. Look at that. That's the first bass. See, I told you, I thought something was messing with it. Get him, Mike, get him. What you got? Mike's got another crappie, y'all. Look at that. Looks like a nice crappie, too. God, oh, that's a bass. That is not a crappie. There's no way that's a crappie. There's no way that's a crappie. That is a monster bass. <gasps> That was a monster bass, dude. Hey, y'all, well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Mike and I showed you how to get on some spring crappie quick, fast, and in a hurry, and by using one of the simplest rigs out there and live bait. No matter how you like to fish or where you like to fish, get outside, go fishing, have fun. You can always become a better angler, and we'll see you on the next cast.